Changeable weather throughout the day today. We started off with our high temperature this morning, and that was 64 degrees. Saw a few rain showers, and then clouds hung on through part of the afternoon and then started breaking up by early this evening. And all, all along, temperatures were slowly and steadily declining. 46 is the current temp right now. The sky is partly cloudy. Humidity is at 73%. The dew point is at 38, which provides a floor for how low the temperature can go tonight officially. And wind is out of the north at 9 miles an hour. Look at temperatures elsewhere. Cranberries at 41, so is Churchill and Bethel Park. 46 in Moon and 42 in Washington. West Mifflin's at 44 and 39 in Latrobe, as well as Indiana. Our 24-hour temperature timeline takes numbers down probably just below 40 degrees officially at the airport. Outlying areas a couple of degrees cooler than that, and you can see numbers will climb into the upper 50s for highs tomorrow afternoon. So that's a seasonably cool day. Average highs about 58 degrees from there. You can see temperatures are going to level off in the mid 50s tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. So it looks like a mild night tomorrow night, which will provide a high launching pad on Sunday for what's going to be a very mild afternoon. We'll get to those details momentarily. First, let's step you through hour by hour. We'll start our clock at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Sunshine to start your Saturday. So if you have uh, soccer games or maybe things to do outside, raking leaves or maybe undecorating for the Halloween decorations, do it tomorrow. Looks like a dry day from start to finish, although we'll see clouds increasing over the course of the afternoon. 3 o'clock, a mostly cloudy sky. Keep things dry, though. Well beyond sunset, 10 o'clock, a lot of clouds across the area. And our one opportunity for showers this weekend will come overnight tomorrow night and early into the day on Sunday. You can see at 9 a.m., Couple spotty showers, but they'll move out quickly. And by 11 o'clock Sunday and beyond, the rest of the day looks to be dry. At that point, though, despite the lack of sunshine, we should have a strong southerly flow, which are going to push temperatures into the mid and upper 60s for highs the second half of the weekend. Surface map shows the front that came through here this morning well down to the south. High pressure keeps things dry tonight and throughout much of the day tomorrow as well. Six o'clock again. The warm front off to our south and west starting to spread clouds back into the area. As that passes, that is what's going to set off a few showers tomorrow night, early Sunday morning. We're firmly into that warmer, milder sector of air Sunday afternoon. Again, a southerly flow pushing temperatures well into the 60s. Our next opportunity for potentially more numerous showers will come Monday. Cold front approaches. This mess of rain gets here on Monday. And of course, another reminder, this is the weekend one hour back with our clocks Saturday night. Daylight saving time comes to an end. We gain an hour of sleep, but unfortunately the sun will be setting 515 Sunday forecast tonight. 38 the low temperature, partly cloudy sky tomorrow. 58 the high temperature sunshine giving way to some clouds in the afternoon. A couple of showers tomorrow night, a couple around hit and miss fashion or Sunday morning. Sunday afternoon, mostly cloudy, 68 degrees, so it looks like much of the weekend will be rain free. Monday, the rainy day, periods of rain 62 and then turning cooler by the middle part of next week.